Jennifer Aniston is in a new film. In Netflix's Dumplin', the beloved star plays a former beauty queen called Rosie, whose neglected daughter enters a beauty pageant in protest. She goes on to find support and encouragement in the music of Dolly Parton and a group of drag queens, who also happen to be Dolly Parton impersonators. Parton herself doesn't appear in the film, but she was commissioned to curate and even wrote some new songs for the movie's soundtrack. During the course of the filming and the press junkets that followed, Aniston and Parton cemented their friendship, resulting in all kinds of funny and fresh quotes for the media to latch onto. In one particularly sensational piece of news, it seems that Parton, her husband, and Aniston were eyeing the possibility of a threesome. If you want to find out more about this titillating bit of Dumplin' trivia, along with a host of other insights into this new Netflix blockbuster, keep watching. Dolly Parton and Jennifer Aniston might have a threesome. It was on The Tonight Show that 72-year-old Dolly told host Jimmy Fallon she was considering a threesome with her, her husband of more than half a century, Carl Thomas Dean, and actress Jennifer Aniston. Fallon doesn't shock easily, but he certainly looks startled. Audience members and TV watchers at home were waiting with bated breath to hear more. The tidbit came up as Parton and Fallon discussed her involvement in a new Netflix movie called Dumplin', starring Jennifer Aniston and featuring music by Dolly. I love her to death, Parton said of Aniston. Apparently, so does her husband, who she went on to say is crazy about the former Friends star and was more excited that his wife was doing a movie with Aniston than he was about her curating the soundtrack. In fact, she continued, quote, I think he fantasizes like a threesome. Fallon collapsed with laughter following her pronouncement, as everyone wondered how serious Parton actually was. Jennifer Aniston was shocked by Dolly's frankness. When Aniston heard the reveal about the proposed dalliance, she was shocked. Quote, My mouth just dropped, she admitted to USA Today. However, Aniston's surprise quickly turned to laughter, as she realized Dolly was just putting it on for the cameras. Aniston explained she expected those kinds of comments from the country legend. She's classic, outrageous, and always colorful. In fact, it's that larger-than-life persona that draws the plus-sized teen at the center of Dumplin', played by actor Danielle McDonald, to Parton in the first place. It's the legend of Parton that inspires her to enter a pageant despite, or in spite of, a dismissal by her former beauty queen mother. More than anything else, Aniston was actually flattered by Parton's threesome throwaway. Hey, if you're enjoying this video, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Dolly Parton and Jennifer Aniston are longtime friends. Dolly and Jennifer got on the phone to chat about the quip, though they haven't exactly set up a date in the calendar for the illicit liaison. Aniston is the first to admit the whole thing was just talk show fodder. What is 100% real, however, is the remarkable friendship between Aniston and Parton. They've shared many a meal at one another's homes, and they're even pen pals. According to Aniston, Parton doesn't write emails or send texts, and she's definitely not active on social media. Instead, she communicates the old-fashioned way by writing letters to her friends and family. And she's happy to chat on the home phone if one of her famous friends calls. Jennifer Aniston recorded a song with Dolly Parton. In another interview about the Netflix drama, Jennifer and Dolly revealed how they teamed up to create Parton's latest country pop song, Push and Pull. Aniston, who isn't a professional singer, said it was a lot of fun. It was the first time she'd ever recorded a song for any of the 43 films she starred in to date. At the start, she had a lot of stage fright and wasn't able to sing. But Parton was on hand to reassure her friend and help her work on the harmonies. You couldn't ask for a better singing teacher. Danielle McDonald, who plays Dumplin', also participated. Dolly Parton loves Jennifer Aniston's Texan accent. Aniston had to cultivate a convincing Texan accent for her role in Dumplin'. Thankfully, she's used to changing her voice. She's been Irish and, of course, had a New York accent before, but the distinctive Southern twang was something new. Thankfully, Dolly approved of her efforts, telling her she thinks she did a great job. At least Aniston is American. Another member of the cast had a much harder time nailing the performance. Danielle McDonald hails from Sydney, Australia, and had to work really hard to get her Texan to a reasonable level, saying it was the most challenging aspect of her entire performance in the movie. The duo snuck past fans into a regular theater to watch the movie. 
The storyline of Dumplin' centers around a reluctant teen beauty queen's love of Dolly Parton and her music. So anyone watching the film will be excited to hear a lot of past and even six brand new songs by the country music legend. To get a feel for the way in which her music influenced the actors, Parton spent a lot of time with Aniston and McDonald, both on and off set. Once the movie was released, the stars had less reason to stick together so much, but that didn't stop them from teaming up once again in a sneaky attempt to watch the film in person. Apparently, Aniston and Parton snuck into a screening of Dumplin' and watched the movie incognito, sitting themselves in the back. Amazingly, no one noticed their presence, even though the theater was chock full of diehard fans. Dolly Parton got emotional during the screening. Dumplin' is a funny movie, but it also has heartwarming moments. Aniston and Parton weren't long in the theater when Parton started panicking. She'd been desperately trying to stifle her laughs. Why? Because they were surrounded by fans, and she was convinced everyone would recognize her by her distinctive chuckle alone. While Parton managed to keep the laughter inside, she found it harder to stop the tears. As humorous as the film is, there are also some endearing and downright emotional moments. Dolly is notoriously warm-hearted, and Aniston caught her crying in the middle of Dumplin'. Jennifer Aniston mistakes a drag queen for Dolly Parton Before Dolly had even stepped foot on the set of Dumplin', some stars were thinking they had already spotted her, including Aniston. In fact, it was Jason Cosmo, one of the Dolly impersonating drag queens, who also featured in the movie. The confusion came about because some of the production team had said Parton might visit the set early, so everyone was excited to meet her. Jennifer spotted Cosmo from way across the set and strode up to him, thinking it was Dolly. At the end of the day, it's a testament to the fantastic impersonation work of the highly talented Jason Cosmo, and everyone on set found the mistake hilarious. When it came time for Danielle McDonald to meet the real Dolly, she was starstruck. Apparently, no one had told her she was going to meet her, so the encounter was a complete surprise. Dolly and Jennifer love the positive messages in Dumplin'. Like many great movies, Netflix's Dumplin' is based on a 2015 novel by writer Julie Murphy, and little did anyone know that Dolly Parton already owned a copy of the book and loved it. She raved about the positive messages and loved that it promoted the idea that, quote, you don't have to look like everybody else to be special and beautiful. Aniston is also said to embody the film's kindly spirit. Everyone on set was blown away by her generosity and passion for the project. Apparently, the film resonated with Aniston, reminding her of her relationship with her own mother. She would regularly perform friendly gestures for the team. On one occasion, she ordered a milk and cookies food truck to the set when everyone was stuck getting through a grueling overnight shoot. Now it's time to hear from you. Will you watch Netflix's newest drama, Dumplin', or will you skip it? Let us know in the comment section below. And before you go, make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to Factsverse if you haven't already. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.